Oh no, it's doing the same thing as it did earlier, come on. Oh no, it's doing the same thing as it did earlier, come on. This wides why. <sighs> this is why I cannot wait. Having intermission issues, y'all. I don't know what's going on with my stream. I might have to quit and delete the stream because it's acting weird. What? What? What in the world just happened, dude? It freaked out for no reason. Okay. What just happened? That just became weird. There we go. Well, that was weird. That had got that has got to be the wor the weirdest error I have ever gotten in this stream before. Like, wow, that has to be the weirdest error I have ever gotten on that stream on this stream ever. Where the whole thing just crashed like it did not want to do anything at first, which is not normal for this stream to do. But I mean, as long as everything's okay, I guess. Yeah, look, everything looks okay. So. But anyways, we got that fixed and out of the way. What is up, you guys? The Blue Jay Player here. And welcome back to another uh, ca Call of the Wild, the Angler Countdown. In this stream, we are actually continuing our little work on the, on the uh, career mode. And... I'm not gonna lie, 
I'm actually pretty hyped to do this one, because, uh, to be doing the continuation of this career mode, because I really, I can't wait to whenever I get done, I'm going to try to cut out my dude, my dude at, with all his sponsors and stuff eventually. Right now, I can't do any of that because he doesn't have a sponsor. He only has one. That's not enough. I need more than just that. He needs more than just one sponsor. So, we are actually going to continue doing the uh, tournaments. And today, we're actually going to go to Wolsey, Germany. And we're actually going to be continuing our carp adventure, so this ought to be interesting, hopefully so. So, without further ado, let's get the tour started. So we have 23 matches, so we'll see how this goes. Uh, just make sure I have the right tackle. Everything's the right thing as always. Let's go. Ah. <sighs> So I hope, hope you guys are having a wonderful uh, Saturday uh, day today. Saturday is the most lovely day of always at the beginning of the weekend. Because you have Friday, which is the beginning of a good weekend. And everything. I've actually been here. This is not a bad map, actually. This is actually a pretty nice map. I've been, I think I've been here. Welcome to the next event on the tour. While the competitors are making their final checks over their tackle, let's take a look at the rules for today's event. Of course, get top, top 25 and our sponsors will be happy with a good check. Let's do this. So yeah, our goal right now is to get a whole lot of sponsors and everything going. Let's put the peg down. Uh, we're just gonna randomly cast this in a spot over here. Good. I wonder who we're gonna catch today. I've never fit. I've been here once and I never fished here ever again. I forgot to change the corn on this thing. I think. I'll have to take a look. Let me see. Yeah, I forgot to change the sweet corn, so hopefully something interesting will happen. I doubt it, though, because that corn never really didn't do the job very well in the last uh, tournament. Uh, for real? I'm stuck. Which one's already getting it? Oh, number one's already got one. What is it? It is a carp. We got a carp on the first bite, too. I can tell that one's not a bream because that is would if that was a bream, that would be a, that would have like a different color, but this is a carp already. So far, the first cast on number one, we already got one. Now, I know this tournament is probably not going to be as easy as the other ones were. The only reason why I feel like it's not going to be easy is because the fact that... That we're like... How do I say, like, not that close. I'm going to try casting number two on number one on the right side this time. I'm here. There you go. And that is a big boy right there. 30 pounds. Holy smokes. Alright, gotta catch. Um, 
I did say I want to try getting over here. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be a good spot. I feel like we need to cast number two there, too. I'm all, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this double sweet corn thing, cause that that really failed us the last time. Mm. Before I can even do that, wonder what we got on the line here. Is that a carp or is it a bream? Oh, it's a koi carp! Oh, one of my beauties. I love those koi carps. These koi carps is the best thing you can catch out of the game. Like, seriously. No doubt about it. This is like the best creature you can catch in this game. So yeah, we're going to hopefully get more memberships on our outfits. So we could sponsor every one of the company. And plus, since we don't really even get money as much, since we don't really even get money, like, from the actual events of this career mode, we only get it, it goes through our, like, payment plan and stuff in this game. I'm just gonna just get all of them on there. I mean, because who could care less how much of you, what you own and stuff. Those beauties. And I see number two is already hooked up. For number one. Nice. That is a 22 pound koi carp. Ooh, beauty. Alright. Something's pulling this thing. Is it a carp or is it a bream? It might be a bream the way it looks. Oh! Yep, it's a carp. This carp is coming in. Oh, by the way, guys, so I checked on the uh, wish list for the angler we only have three weeks until the angler is available so if you guys not have not done it wish list the game now so you could be notified by steam or e i don't know if wish of epic games has a wish list but wish list that game right now and get a notification so you could be notified when the game is actually available to be bought because i want everyone who had because like everyone's concerned like, lately in the Discord for the uh, Angler, everyone's been concerned about why there has not been no information on the game. I feel like they want everyone to experience it for themselves. I feel like the game company wants them to experience it themselves. Because Expansive Worlds made good products, no matter what. And there we go. 19 pound uh, carb. Not too shabby. We're already in the lead. Holy smokes. We're already in the lead. This is just turned out crazy. What the heck, bro? I'm just going to cast over here in this coastline thing. And now we need to change the bait. I can't change for one second. Oh my god. I can't. I mean, I can't complain. Oh, it's another one. That's another cart. That one looks giant. So now, now everyone... 
I really am gonna wonder though, because the company, like I, like everyone said, the company has not released information. I wonder how the game's gonna feel when you first get it. Like, how is the game gonna work? Is it gonna be like a whole lot different compared to the uh, Call of the to the Hunter Call of the Wild? What kind of mechanics are we gonna be dealing with here? Because from what we've seen in the trailer so far. All we're getting is just like bits and pieces of little information that we got boats, we could cast a rod, we could do all that. But we don't really have exactly a gameplay. And everyone's wondering, everyone is wondering what it could be. Come here. Yeah, coffee copy. We're almost there. Come here. Nope, don't you get caught this way. Bring it in. And there she goes. Another one. That's a leather carp. Oh no, it's a mirror carp. 30 pounds too. Not too shabby. Guess somewhere where I cast number one, there's nothing coming. Good god, already two's already got one on the line. Dang. Another carp! Heck yeah, bro! By this point, I could just stop and literally not even fish anymore. But no, I'm just gonna keep going. Because you never know what you're going to get yourself into. Dang, this thing is really fighting. Come on now. This fish is just fighting, and he's literally not. There's nothing he can even do to, to even escape it. Like, what the heck? What a beauty. This has to be another mirror carp. Yep, 28 pounds, dude. This is good. Alright, we're casting one over here again. There's, I mean, two. Now we need to cast one. There we go. Oh. Seems like one of them was about to get a bite. Well, why did I click the check mark? Whoops. And one's already got one. Sup, Cars Ignite 95. Welcome back. Welcome back. And I'm glad you're able to make it to another stream of mine. This one's a small one. Also, yesterday you missed it. Um. I caught Big Joe, Big Fat Joe, yesterday. I caught an another trophy named fish named Fat Joe. You missed it in yesterday's stream. 
when I was doing the career mode. I caught Fat Joe yesterday. And along in England. So that is like our 12th trophy fish that we have gotten. And also, we got our little selves a sponsorship in the game. Name the Bait Shack has given us a sponsor in the game, so this is pretty cool. And another smallie. Another cart. Not too shabby. Alright. As I was trying to do was sort the bait. Okay, so we got the tiger nuts. I wonder what's the difference between the tiger nuts and the pop-up nut tiger nuts. I'm about to find out here in a moment. Just try to cast this where number two is. Good enough. Heck yeah. And as you can already tell, we're already... Alright, we got another fish on. But yeah, so we got big fat, we got Fat Joe yesterday. It got me by surprise. Fat Joe was the reason why I was in first place anyhow in London. Like, if it were for Fat Joe, I don't think I would have won that tournament. And the funniest thing is, what in the world of a name for a cart, Fat Joe? That's gotta be the most funniest name for a fish, Fat Joe. Like, just imagine you go up to the fish and be like, hey, or go up to a cart, hey, there's Fat Joe, he's right there. <laughs> like, what the heck, dude? Like, I don't get that. How do you get Fat Joe out of everything? That is... It's pretty hilarious. That's what I'm saying. I think the company was just bored because they were like, okay, we got to toss up. We got to toss out some names. And yeah. Another mirror cart. 28 pounds. So nothing so mo far from the three. Maybe it's just because it's in the weeds, most likely. But hey, who knows? So there's nothing else so far from these two. Although I am going to keep the popping tiger nuts on there. Because I want to do a little test and see maybe it might catch me a carp. It's not going to do it right now obviously. Because we are just about to win this tournament. Ugh. Let's get my hair all figured out. There we go. As soon as it hits the two minute mark, I'm just going to wrap up my equipment because I am stuck here. Because look, I could not move anywhere. Like, I am completely stuck here. 
I'm literally doing the moonwalk right now. Like, what the heck, dude? Like, if, even when I go walking this way, I'm literally doing the moonwalk. What is this? Because I actually want to roam around the map and actually take a look and see what... Take a look at this map. Alright. There we go. I actually like this map. It's very wooded, and it's very, very intriguing how every part of this map is like woods. Of course, you got these little decks around the lake and stuff, which I think is pretty, pretty cool. I just can't wait that... I just can't wait for the angler to come to come out. Then that way you can free roam the whole entire map indefinitely of what you can find. Because, like, I want to know what you're going to be able to find. I want to know what you're going to be able to seek. Like, I want every bit of it. When we play the uh, angler, I cannot wait to free roam. That's like the biggest factor. Is that we go around testing out these other lakes, and it's like you never know what you're gonna get yourself into until you play it. So I hopefully hope that we'll be actually able to, you know. I tell you, it's uh, it's o fish out uh, that the anglers. Huh? What do you mean by that, mister? I'm not getting it. Is it like supposed to be a pun or something? Because <laughs> I'm not getting it. It's, I tell you, it's old fish owl that the angler er, is coming out. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and we're done. In the course of that, we literally caught pretty nice sized fish. We win the tournament, and we got ourselves three hundred points with a total of a thousand followers on this on this career, and I got twenty eight thousand dollars. I think you unlock a Oh. Oh! <laughs> I should have caught that. Let me read that again. It, I tell you, it's official. I should have caught that. Hey, that's what I want as my main sponsor right there. Oh, I can't. <sighs> I am actually going to put Honcho as my sponsor. Now, where is Honcho at? Nova. Chill. Crazy dog. I'm wondering where that. Oh, oh, it's in the back. I just now noticed. Oh, it's on the arm. Oh, okay, okay. I see that. I see that. Okay, I see. You. Mm -hmm. I see you now. Uh, for the carp sponsors. Let's check the carp. I'll take that sponsor for the carp as well. I'm trying to get it. Oh, oh, oops, oops. Continue career. <laughs> Whoops. I did not mean to actually exit out of there. Okay. So we have two sponsors now. We actually have Bait Shack and Had Chow. Let's go. Already two sponsors. And we're going to my favorite favorite lake like that I've always wanted to go to Lake Arnold in Tennessee now, I already know a perfect spot at Lake Arnold there's actually a specific spot that I go to, to catch a bass let's go let's make sure we have our bass equipment equipped let's go 
Let's go to Lake Arnold in Tennessee. Let's go. Now, I really wish the company, when they did at Lake Arnold, they would have also added the lake, the uh, Tennessee River. That would be a fun river to fish in, is the Tennessee River. Beautiful river, in my, in my opinion. But yeah, that the angler is coming out at the end of this month. Like, it, we're getting close. This countdown has been so worth it, though. Hi there, and welcome to the next event on the tour. With prize money and tour points up for grabs, there's a lot at stake for each of our competitors. So let's take a look at the rules ahead of today's competition. Reach top 25. So our sponsors uh, are Honcho and our and our uh, Bait Bait uh, Shack wants us to get to top 25. So. Alrighty, and I know where we're at. We're in a good position too. Yeah, we're in a good position. We need to find that little, little corner. There's a little corner somewhere close to us. It's near Sandy, Shor Sandy Shores. That's where we need to go to. Sandy Shores has got the trees. Right this way. It's go time for one of my favorite bass locations, dude. But yeah, this is Lake Arnold and uh Okay, so we go straight ahead. Yes, right this way. Yes, 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 yes. Well so what we do, we just pull up, turn a little bit straight, and as soon as we hit the invisible wall, that's when we know we're next to the shoreline. Which is right here. Yes, baby, let's go. Okay. Let's see what we can catch here. I'd be surprised we we catch a bass right off the bat. <laughs> I'm going to use this special rattle bait. This bait has never disappointed me at all. Sorry for what? What are you sorry about? <laughs> Don't tell me you mispressed that. Don't tell me you mispressed that. <laughs> She's like, oh, come on. Yo, we got one. Okay, so it's a tiny bass, but hey, we'll take it for now. It was an accident. Hey, it's fine, bro. It's fine. Okay. That's not good so far. We've only caught a smallmouth bass that was a baby. So we need bigger fish. Come on. We gotta get better than this. Come on, company. I mean, come on, guys. We got a company wishing on us. We got two companies. They're wishing us an opportunity and a fish. Oh! Oh! My God, he got yeeted again! <laughs> Come on, we got you. You're coming with me. We gotta be careful. So, how's your day been so far? Been pretty good. We went to Sam's Club today. Four pounds. We went to Sam's Club today to get me a few things, and plus, not only that, I also got me a few things to eat as well too. Yeah. last night I also stayed up until two o'clock because my sister and I had to do a few things and my mom was up we went to a McDonald's that was open 24 7 because she was hungry oh yes I got you <laughs> hey this is why I love this lure this lure gets the job done 
heck yeah! You're coming with me! I am bringing home in my hometown of Tennessee! This is my hometown. This is how you get the job done, bro. I'm bringing a, I'm bringing a win in my hometown of Tennessee. But yeah, if you ever need to win a tournament, go to this area right next to the San, San Rock Shores. This area will get you... I mean, it's going to be small ones at first, but as soon as you keep casting it, then big ones are just going to pop in your face. Like this one. Literally pops in your face. He like, pop. Crazy. I'm crazy. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm really crazy. I know. Come here! There's no hiding you! We all know how beautiful you look. Oh god! Yes! We got it in! That's not a bad side bass! It's probably like a six pounder. Seven pounder actually! Okay! Seven pounds! We're already in the lead! Yeah, just keep casting this honestly. It's the best lure in my opinion. Oh yeah, we gotta make these sponsors in this game happy. They want us to win that money. And get us the wins. They're like, you give us money? I mean, you get us the wins? What the heck, bro? What is up with my yanking today? Another baby. But hey. I'll take it. But what's up with my casting on my lines? Do I need to, like, yank... Let me get my lines up a little bit because I've yanked that sucker and it's get, still giving me poor strike. What is this game? There we go. Again, a baby. But the more you keep fishing here, the more big ones come. Three pounds, not too shabby. Honestly, it doesn't even matter what size you get. It's just as long as you can catch it. That's all that matters. Oh, I seen that big... I see you, big boy. I see you poking there. You will be mine. Come here! Come here! Oh my god, is that another small one? <laughs> I see the bigger one! What are you doing here? I don't want you. Oh, man. I guess I... Oh, that's actually a pretty nice small one. Is that a spotted? Yes, that's a spotted. It's a one pound. <laughs> is there something fishy going on here? Um, I mean, you could say there is. Oh, where did you come from, bro? What the heck? Where did he come from? That fish just came out of nowhere. I think it was just following my lure. What the heck? Now, you're probably wondering, what is the goal of this? What is your goal for this game? I'm actually trying to get all the sponsors and now in this career mode, I'm actually tempted to get all sponsors. Because as you can tell, my vest is all blue. I want to turn that blue into something special. So I hope you guys are really enjoying this career thing. I really am enjoying it as much as you guys are. Because this career thing is actually something I didn't even think was actually going to be any good. I usually get bored of career modes very quickly. But this one's like outstanding. I love how it just gives you the options. Just you fish. You do whatever you want. Get sponsors. Yada, yada, yada. You name it. Come here. It's a big bass. There you 
go. Here we go. Oh, that's a nice one. I'm guessing he's a seven pounder too. An eight pounder. Okay, we're already got an eight pound. We already got an eight pounder up in here. <laughs> Look at me already winning the tournament. This is how. This goes to show you. I literally take my time to grind all for the items. The career mode is great so far. I know. Oh, it's about to get harder. For what the guy was saying, it gets a lot harder. If you really want to get up in the, uh, the you will be invited to the in, the special league. That like where all the pros go. And I'm not looking forward to that one. Oh, dude, how is that a pro strike? Oh my goodness, man, how does that work? How does that work? Get a poor strike. Bruh. This lure is such a good lure. I literally am so thankful I bought all these lures just to test out. Don't you do it. Don't you snag off. I'm going to get a win in my home state of Tennessee. Because we're in Lake Arnold. Such a great state. I mean, such a great, uh, lake. That's not bad. Probably like a four-pounder. A five-pounder! What the heck? I'm getting guesses wrong today. I'm thinking it's a five-pounder. I mean, a four-pounder, and then it gives me five. And then when I'm thinking six, it gives me a seven. Then when I think seven, it gives me an eight. What the heck, game? What is this? What sorcery is this? I have to increase my drag. I'm doing that. Just waiting for it. Waiting for it. Of course, nothing comes that way. That's okay. Right there. Perfect. Oh! There we go. See? That's what I'm talking about. So how is your day going, Cars Ignite? Hope your day is going good. And we got another baby pass. <laughs> this game. I'm two pounder. This is this is funny. Hey, it's getting the job done though. Heck yeah. I don't know if that cat counts anymore. Uh, no, it counts. Got him! Yes! Let's go! Another giant bass on the line. Let's go. That's good. I'm glad your day is going good. Okay. Ha. It's in and it's mine. Let's go. Five pounds. Heck yeah, bro. These basses are getting bigger by the better. I think I cast it a little too far. That was actually went right in. That actually fit through. Not too shabby. I'll take it. Just waiting for it. Just waiting for it. Ah, not today. Nobody's home. Yes. 
That big bass came out of nowhere. Holy smokes. Let's go for it. Come here. Thank goodness you haven't thought about hiring a DJ. Which <laughs> he was. God, and that is perfect. <laughs> nice bass. Eight pounds, too. All right. Okay. We're actually getting some bass today. Hmm. We're getting them in. Oh my God, you and those puns. Okay. It's acting weird. He got yeeted a mile away. Which one is this? Is this a bass? Oh, yes, it is. It's another tiny one. It's a two pounder. Yes, I got it. Yes, finally. Got something right for once. It's a two pounder. All right. Oh, right in the corner of the tree. That is not too shabby. The bit. I'm just waiting for it. Just waiting for it. Oh, I just seen him. I just seen him swing. Come on. <gasps> Give me. Wow. Those basses came for it and didn't even bite it. I see the reflection in the water. Those basses did not come for it. Not even nibble it. This time they do. This one did. Or is that even? Or oh, it is a bass. I was to say. Or that is that a walleye? Because I see the walleye pop poking around. Finally, there's something we could get. We could bring in. There we go. Three pounder, I have to guess. Four pounder! What? How? How? What sorcery is this? Alright, one more cast and I'm gonna get out of here. But yeah, I know where I'm coming to every time I go to this place. Okay, we got another one on the line. It's a big one, too. I think this is the one that was poking it around. Yep, that's a bit. That's the chubby. That's the funky. That is the chunky right there. Come here, buddy. If you could come in here, that'd be great, because then I could get back to the boat docking time. Actually, not a bad spot when you need to grind for bass. I tell you, this is like a hot spot for bass completely. Come on, come on, any moment now.
I'm here. I'm here, dude. I only got a minute. Get in this boat. Dang it. I'm not going to make it in time to the boat, dog. What the way he's been doing? Come here. Ah. Come here. Yes. He is in. Okay, this has to be a big one. Holy smokes! That is an 11 pounder! Woo! Okay, I will take that. I'm getting, I gotta get back to that dock fast. Nope, there's no way. I'm not making it to that dock. There's no way. Bro, that is an 11 pounder! Holy smokes, that's a big one. Three, two, one, and done. That was the biggest bass was that 11 powder. Holy smokes. And we, are in a and we won first place. We were already in first place, but that fish boosted it up. Ha! Let's go! And we're already in the lead. And I get a win in my home state of Tennessee. Let's go. And I get my earnings and I have myself 1,200 followers. Holy smokes, we're already at 1,200 followers. Man, look at that. We have won about, we have won about six events. Now we are actually going to a place in Poland, I think. Yeah, I think Poland. So my goal today is actually try to get to number 20, if we can get that far. Get to number 20. Oh, we're going night fishing here. Ooh, babe, I've never night fished my way in this game, so this is gonna be an actually an opportune new thing to me. Let's go night fishing, bro. This is gonna be awesome. Heck yeah, dude! Let's go. Now I'm gonna have myself these uh organic little stick things. Join us here on the water today as the competitors are getting ready for the start of this exciting event. While we wait for the action to begin, let's take a look at the rules for today's tournament. As always, place top 25, get that money! Oh my! Crazy people driving like they have no common sense down here. I'm sorry if you guys heard like a freaking car speeding like they're maniacs. I'm sorry about that. People just don't... There's this car... Okay. Prepare for a ramp mode. There's this person that keeps speeding in our neighborhood like he just doesn't care. Like, he just speeds the car. And it gets very annoying because every day he does it. He will just speed it like it ain't nothing. It's the most annoying thing. I've been so tempted to call the police on him because we have seen him multiple times do it.
I'm sorry that I'm sorry guys that I just had to rant about that. That's just annoying. That that person speeds like he like he literally wants to drive crazy. Makes no sense. I feel like this tournament might be a little difficult. Honestly, I could have gone to a better spot if I really am going to be honest. I'm going to cast over here, maybe see if something will happen. We just gotta cast in different spots. Right there. I feel like that's where we need to cast. I feel like that's where we need to cast. Cause where I feel like I just cast Oh no wait, there was a little pitch of a spot for a split second. Where is that? Right there. I actually found a good spot right there. So technically, we don't even need to cast further. Yeah, right there will work. What did I say? What did I say? Already! Bring in this car, baby. Yep, there he is. See, I needed I knew I had to cast at a good certain spot, but we got it now. <laughs> so I'm guessing this might be your longest stream for the countdown. Yes, because I actually wasn't able to stream earlier like I was tend to, because like I said, I had to go to I had to go to Sam's Club today, do a few things, go to Walmart, get a few things, and so pretty much I wasn't able to do a whole lot today at the house because I had to go out and do a few things. So that's why I feel like this might be the longest stream, and that's what my goal is, is to hit to 20. And there's that lag spike. 17! Don't think that's gonna put me up yeah that's gonna put me up in the little bit of the leaderboards but that's not enough what do we have on the line i'm actually curious did we actually get a carp oh it's a freaking bream what the heck how can i not cut the line what the heck That is disappointing. I can't cut the line to let it go. Ugh. Well, we now know this doesn't... This isn't the only thing that attracts. It also attracts the freaking breams. What is it? Is it a freaking bream or is it a freaking carp? Come here, dude. What are you? I called it. Get your butt out of here, Bream. This isn't your time. Alright, let's go. Try this again. I hope this is a carp and not a Bream. Oh, one of my favorites! It's a Koi Carp. Oh, these are my beauties. Dude, the Koi Carps is a, such a beautiful carp. Like, I love... The koi carps more than any other species of carp. Like this is why I hope we get a Japan map in in the angler in the future because I would love to go fishing for some koi. Your butt ain't gonna defeat me. I don't care how you guys get me up, get me down. These sponsorships are expecting a big paycheck out of me.
There we go. Ten pounds. Ooh. Okay. All right. I'm definitely changing this bait because for some reason it attracted a freaking bream. Okay, there we go. Don't know if this is going to work, but it's worth a try. Any moment now. Hey, Cobalt Steel, how are you, sir? I hope you're doing a great as well, and I hope you're getting better, man. Ugh. Seriously? Uh-uh. I'm going to a switch into a de gum different spot. We need to go somewhere where I feel like I'm going to catch some. Right there. I don't care if I lose my peg. Get out of here with you just telling me about that game. I get it. You're going to lose your peg if you don't blah, 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 blah. Who cares? Now, where am I supposed to go? Is it between here? Uh-uh. Where? <sighs> Bro. Oh, my God. It's going to be one of these m ones that you have to fiddle with it. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. I hate the ones you got to fiddle with. See? These are the ones you got to fiddle with. Is it because I literally left that... I know I'm looking for a piece of wood, but where is it? Plus, I can't see because it's so dark. I... I see a little flat area. Hopefully, I'll have enough time to freaking get it. It's always got to be the ones where I got to go slow. I 
All right. Hopefully, we could try to make a good point out of this. All right, cast here. It's not bad. Splash one. Cast over here. It's two. Okay. I take that other one from the weeds. What do we got? Hopefully it's something big because we need to get up there. We only have a little bit of points. Uh oh. Don't tell me that's a bream. Yep, that's gotta be a bream. Oh no, wait! I don't know. What do you call a fish with no eye? Oh my god. Give me that fish. Dang it. It looks like I'm going to have to cast these very far out. Now, because they're not... They're just giving me nothing but breams. Be <laughs> All right, please. Yes, it's a carp. Heck yes, this is what we need. Give us, give it to me. We need it. This is our only chance to get this carp in. Fish. Oh my god. <laughs> I see what you did there. Okay, okay. You wrong for that. You wrong for that. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. What do you call a fish with no eye? Fish. <laughs> Alright. Alright, no playing games, dude. I only got six minutes on the clock. No more playing these games. Bring your butt in. I'm being for real. Come on. Alright. Yes. There we go. 19 pounds. That's got to put us up there now. Come on. Thank you. Now we got to be serious. Oh, is that a koi? Or is that a bream? Oh, it's a koi. Oh, yes. One of my beauties. I love these fish. Honestly, this almost had me. This freaking match almost had me because I had no idea where we were supposed to go. This match had me. Now, if the map was, like, light, I probably would have had it, but I had no idea where I was supposed to go. If I'm going to be honest. I have no idea where I was supposed to go. At least the sponsors will be happy, because I got myself up in this lead. Beautiful koi carp. 13 pounds. Not too shabby. Alright, so we got... One's already got one on the line. And it's very far out now. I wonder what's on the end. Because they pulled it really far out. Oh my god, it, don't tell me it's a freaking bream. I'm done if it's a bream. It is a freaking bream. I swear, the breams of this are so connected to this bait. I don't like it. Oh my goodness. I think it's because there's no night vision bait on here. I do remember there was one that did say there was some night vision bait. Let me actually check if that actually would work. Uh, I'm actually going to put that on number three. 
it is not the sweet corn. It is where is it? It's the, where it's this green one. This one, night glows. Yes, that's what we need. How do fish go shopping? I don't know. How do they go shopping, Mr. Car is Ignite95? Alright, let's see if that works. I doubt it's going to really make a difference. <laughs> oh, look at it. <laughs> On lie. I get it because it says line instead of on line. Online, it's on line. Oh my god! Hey, I got a question for you. What grocery store do the fish go shopping at? Fish bait. Cause get no bait store. Get it? Get it? Bait store? Because that's where everyone, that's where the fish love to, to get their food. Bait store. Because that's what you get to feed the fish. Basically. Oh my god, I'm cracking up on my own joke. Okay. Alright, something's gotta happen. Come on. They're already on freaking... 47, dude. Come on. Don't do this to me, game. Don't you mess me over, game. I will not like you if you do this to me. Please be nice. Please be nice. Please tell me this is a carp. I'm gonna cry if it's not. It is! It's one of my favorite species! The game gods have answered! Yes! I will take you. Come here, buddy. You're coming with me. I'm gonna need you. Hope I have enough time to bring you in, bro. Oh... Come on! I only got a minute! Oh, yes! Holy smokes, we got it in! 11 pounds, I don't care. I will take it. Yes! Yes! We're up there! Heck yes! Holy smokes, this has got to be the most toughest tournament that actually was one of the toughest ones that I've actually participated in. Because I couldn't see a thing where we were supposed to go. And plus this is a new map. I will say, though, the mountains in this game are very beautiful, along with the woods environment. Like, this is how I visualize Call of the Wild is going to be for the angler. Where you could go up the mountains, you could go everywhere. Like, I can't wait for this game. I can't wait for a game like that to come out. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3... Two, one, and done. Holy smokes. How many breams did we catch? I'm going to have to re tell. Why shouldn't you hire a fish as a phone operator at a business? I don't know why. They'll leave the phone off the hook. They'll, <laughs> they'll 
leave the phone off the hook. Oh my god. I'm so done. I'm so done with you. You were your jokes. Alright, I gotta go let these dogs out. Be right back. I'm so- I can't believe it. <laughs> They'll leave the phone off the hook. Okay, so what do we got? Okay, how many brains did we catch here? I caught about one, two, three of them! I caught three brains! I'm just glad I didn't catch a whole lot. That would have, like, got my nerves up on a twist. So, but hey, we won the tournament! We take the lead! 400 points! Heck yeah! Look at us go! And we're get we got money from our sponsors, and we got 43,000, 43,174 net worth, with a total followers of 1,400. We're getting rich on those followers, bro! I'm in, I've always enjoyed your joke. Hold on a second, guys. I gotta go into intermission real quick.
understand why my freaking BRB thing didn't pop up. I'm gonna have to fix that after the stream. Oh my god. What? <laughs> Dude, you. I'm so glad I was not on the mic. <sighs> Alright, let's keep going. I'm back again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright. Alright. <laughs> what, what did I... What did I just get told about... I don't understand. Okay, so we're actually going to Sandy Creek now. Feels like I didn't even make no progress. All right, we are going to Texas in Lake Travis. Oh my God. Never been to this lake either, so this ought to be something. This ought to be something I've never been to here. And we're going fishing at night, really? Oh boy, i have never, they're giving us night fishing today. What the heck? Before it wasn't even all about the night fishing. Now they're giving us all this night fishing stuff. What the heck is going on? Lake Travis. Never been there. Uh, Hello and welcome to the menu for the next event on the tour. Well, the background's black. The are getting ready for the action to begin. Let's take a look at the rules for today's event. Oh man, we have three hundred points. If you're going to Sandy Creek, watch out for crabs. Oh my God, not the crab dance. In my head what am I thinking of right now okay so I feel like we need to go to an area where that's gonna be a whole bunch of areas like that would be like skinny and whatnot I've actually never been on this map either but it's a good thing cuz I'm testing out a few locations so, hey, never too late to test out a map. Okay. I see there's a whole bunch of fish here. Like, in this area, specifically. Hopefully, we can catch some bass. This ought to be good. This would be great. I mean, this would be great. Oh, what did I get? Oh, what did I get? Is it a bass? I really hope it's not a catfish because I don't got time for this. Oh, it's a bass. I could tell right as soon as it poked. Yep, it jumped. It's a bass. Let's go. Oh, that's a pretty nice sized bass. Oh, it's a spotted bass too. So we're doing pretty good on the tournament so far. We've won first place in every one of them. Okay, what do we got here? We have a spotted bass, I think. Yep, five pounds. Let's go. Oh boy. You might want to wait. <laughs> there has to be something here. I 
I'm gonna try casting four and maybe see something pop up. And by the way, your joke of me, if you like, get lost at sea, you might want a whale for help. That is funny. Okay. Okay. That's not good. That was a terrible poor strike. We need this wind! Come on! Come on, fish! We need this wind! We need to get a win in Texas. We're going to prove everybody that the that we are the best champions of the world of fishing tournaments in history. Oh my god. It is pulling line. There we go. Oh, that is a nice size. Oh, well, how big is it? Eight pounds, bro, and it's a spotted bass. Eight pounds. That is putting us up in the leaderboards. Let's go, bro. They're here. They are here. You just gotta cast and reel. All right, I'm gonna try to cast it near the edges right here and see maybe that makes a difference. Now I'm actually curious if I cast like next to the edges or whatnot. Oh, come on! What was that, dude? I had my light all the way up. How was that not possible of a strike? How was that not possible of a strike? That's not right. This game has literally been antagonizing me on my strikes. They really don't want me to win this tournament at night, do they? Now, I want to know how Fishing at Night's going to be in the actual Call of the Wild, the Angler. That's what I want to know. Because we only seen, like, a little split screenshot of a nighttime darkness when we're when you uh, are able to explore the map and stuff. Oh, boy. That is a nice fish. Spotted bass, six-pounder. Let's go. All right. 20 pa 20. We are in the lead, finally. I thought we was not going to win this, but we did it. At least I now know a spot we gotta go to. We can go to. Just waiting for the frickin' strike. Come on! Oh! Oh, that's a nice one! Oh, I gotta lower down the drag. Holy smokes! That is a nice sized bass! Where did this bad boy come from? say what do you guys think when i get the angler what do you guys think i should do first in the game like besides when i get through the tutorial of course do you think i should go night fishing or do you think i should go day fishing what do you guys think i should do when the game first comes out i want to go night fishing i don't know i feel like night fishing would just be more funner because then you're at night, you could literally chill. But then again, when you're day fishing, you're going to have so much blight and stuff. I don't know. I just feel like there's so many co cons and gains with the uh, fishing at night. Are you kidding me? What is up with these four strikes, man? 
At least this fish didn't give me a fight. That is the tiniest fish. <laughs> start with day fishing. Oh, so you want me to start day fishing? Okay. I feel like day fishing is going to be interesting because the fact that you're going to start the first time in this game, the first time you start the game, you're going to be like thrown out in the world of the angler. Oh, there we go. I'm here! This fish is really giving up a fight, eh? Oh my god! Double... When it makes that sound, you know that is bad when you got a poor strike. So, you, so that's crazy, Cars Ignite95. I'm surprised you wanted me to do day fishing. Why? Are you curious how beautiful the map's gonna be? The game's gonna be? Is that it? <laughs> I kind of figured. Oh, nice bass. Large mouth. Nice! We're doing pretty good so far. We're already in the lead of 31. Just waiting for somebody to actually take it. Pull! Yes! There we go. Oh, it's a baby fish. Another tiny one. What are you doing? I can already imagine this game, like, I mean, the angler having hoppity fishes like this one. Like, what the heck? Woohoo! We already have 31 pounds as it is. Whoa! That daggum thing took my line before I could even have a chance! Whoa! That sucker had took it my line before I even had a chance. Oh, this has got to be a big one if that sucker just took it. Oh, this is giving up a good fight. Oh my god. Oh, dude. I feel like this is a big bass. Wait a minute. That ain't no bass. What is that? I can't tell because of this darkness. This darkness is really not helping me. Oh, it's a bass. Oh, I can tell that's a bass. Okay. Okay. Man, they have thrown some interesting challenges at me, dude. Like, fishing at night and stuff. Like, this is crazy. I never would have thought of fishing at night in this game. And the career mode... I like how the career mode, they throw stuff at you. Like, like unlike, like, unlike when you're playing the free mode, this game is throwing stuff right at you. Right at your face. Okay, that is a big one, too. Probably like an eight-pounder. Six pounds again! Good God! I'm expecting more of a bigger fish. What is this? I'm 
I'm just waiting for it. Oh my goodness, hold on guys, my freaking mom is calling me right on the, uh, right on the stream, so my freaking ringtone is going off. Hang on a second. Lord, I'm trying to fish and I'm getting interrupted in the middle of the stream. What the heck? Oh, my mom, my mom, my mom, my mom. All right. Anyways, let's cast this back out. Because I was right in the middle of the fishing and then I got interrupted right in the middle of a call by her. Something's eventually got a bite. Alright, I'm casting it to the right. I'm going to cast near the shore like last time. There we go. I see something splashing over here. Oh, come on. What is this? Man, you know what? I'm going to use the top lure. I want to see if anything's going to bite this. I'm curious. Now, if we don't hit the t number 20 today, I'm at least wanting to hopefully hit the number 15. Because since I had, like, a lot of interruptions, though. So. But we'll see. Only time will tell. Let's try this worm. The gummy worms, as as cars ignite ninety five likes to call them, gummy worms. Plot twist: they're gummy worms. <laughs> Got it. Yes, there we go. The gummy worms worked its magic. This is what I'm talking about. My goodness.
Come on. Come on in. We need we need another win. Let's go. Plus, I'm going to get to the butt boat dock in time this time. Wait a minute. Is that a walleye or is that a perch? Ah, uh, this fish is really fun. a big one. Oh, it's a 12 pounder, but it's not a tw 12 pound bass. It's not a trophy catch, but that is a nice size bass. Heck yes. That sets the score. Let's get moving. That sets the score. We got ourselves a large bass. That that sets the score. Heck yes. Man, that is not a bad size bass, dude. Okay, we just drive up to the dock and we just park and wait the timer out. All right, if that's as close as we're going to get to the dock, I'll deal with it. Oh, we got ourselves a 12-pound bass. Not a trophy catch, but I will take it because that is a nice size largemouth bass. Ah, let's go, bro. Heck yeah, bro. So now while I'm waiting for this timer, I'm going to check out a few things on my thing. Do, 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 do. What is going on with the timer? Do, 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 do. One minute now. Let's go. We could do this. I can't believe that 12 pound actually saved us. seconds yeah I really have no idea how much what they're gonna be throwing at me next because I mean like I said this tournament has been on and off at throwing me things 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and done yeah the biggest catch out of all those was that 12 pound ba largemouth bass you officially been saved. Oh my god. Really? That? <laughs> 400 points. 
And there's our earnings, and we're getting more of those followers. The companies are happy. We're getting that money brought in and everything. Uh oh, our contract with the abate shack is expiring. Our contract with the with the uh with the bait shack is expiring in two events. No the, the liner. Finally! We're actually not fishing at night, we're actually fishing at sunrise. Because I think the last lake we went to... Yeah, Lake Arnold was sunrise. These two lakes were nighttime. Holy smokes, that was a long one. Manor Farm. Hmm. Never been here. And then we got another lake. Oh, this one's sunrise. Good. Th thank goodness. I was actually getting sick and tired of fishing at night. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's fun, but that's also very annoying because you have no clue where you're going at. Um... Let me go ahead and change this bait real quick back to the, um, the poppin' tiger nuts. Pop-up tiger nuts, which is the bigger version. Alright, let's go! Let's go catch more carps, bro! Let's go, go, go! Hmm. I think we're on. I think this time I need to go somewhere where I can actually have a flat area. This one. Greetings, everybody, and welcome to the next event on the tour. While the competitors are making their final checks over their tackle, let's take a look at the rules for today's event. Place top 25 as always. Let's go make these sponsors happy. Oh, I never fished here either. This is another good map. Whoa, dude. I've actually... Wow, I'm actually impressed with this map. I actually like this one a, l a lot better than the other one. Tiger nuts. I'm trying to find an area where... I guess we'll just cast it there. We'll see what we get out of this. Let's go. Oh, it's enough. Already on our first cast, we got our first carp of this tournament. Holy smokes. Let's go, dude. I gotta say, I'm enjoying this. Like, we have been cruising this tournament. No problem. Now we just got a realist fishing. Come here, buddy. I need you to come here. Come right this way, dude. Number two's already got a fish. What the heck is going on? Bringing this one in.
Oh, this is a big one. 33 pounds. Already put us in the lead. Yep, look at us. 33 pounds. Already in the lead. Dang. Everything's just going smooth. Like, this is going good. Like, compared to the other two tournaments we have previously were just in with the night one, this one's actually turning out to be a lot smoother the ones than the previous ones. Because those previous ones, we were having the struggle of a lifetime. Like, especially with it being night, that was pretty difficult. Unfortunately, we're going to lose our contract with the bait shack. Unfortunately, we're going to lose them. Because we... Because they're pleased with our winnings. Hopefully, we're able to renew with the company. And that's what I plan on doing. I'm planning on renewing that company. It's another carp. Holy smoke. It's an, and it looks like another big one, too. Holy smoke. Is this going to be like the last match we got that we played? Holy smokes. Because the last few matches we've been get we were doing good on the carp tournament. Come here. Come here. There we go. I wonder how big this thing is. 26 pounds. Let's go. That's where I be that's where I saw some bubbles pop up, so there we go. Again, cast this out over here because we've been because we were actually getting some good ones right here. Now I wonder which one's gonna get it. Any moment, one of these could be taken. So now we just wait and chill. Oh! Pop-up. The one with the pop-up has now got a fish on. Oh, it's a carp, I think. I'm here. Oh, it's another carp, but it's a tiny one. Yeah, this is the tiniest carp that we gotten by far. Yeah, bring it right in. Yeah, that's the tiniest carp. Oh, the designs on this one looks. Oh, it's a mirror carp. That's a. That's a weird design of a mirror cart. Once already got a fish. Oh my god. Hey Karzik995, you want to hit me another joke? Are you dished? Are you dish out? Dished out, I mean. Come here. <laughs> he got it right as soon as I saw said that. <laughs> Oh, is that a bream? Oh no! Why do I got a feeling this is a bream? 
probably a bream. Or it could be a carp. Oh, it's a carp. I can tell. It's a darker carp, though. Oh, this is a darker one. It's a, it's a mirror carp. Not a one of those. Hey, there we go. We got another one on the line, too. Hold on a second. Alright, I'm back. I had to check on a something, but I'm back. Okay. Alright. So far we've been catching mirror carbs like crazy. smokes Quint Quinn Connor has already got a 40 pound are you serious you ain't gonna win this And there we go. Another size carp, and that one is a beautiful color. It is a common carp, and it's 27 pounds. Not too shabby. There we go. I hear some crazy splashes coming from this way. So have you heard any knock knocks on the door? If so, you might want to let Sam. Oh my god. Oh my god. So have you ever heard any knocks on the door? If so, you might want to let Sam. Really? Really? The salmon? Wonder what has got himself knocking on the door recently? Why why have you been knocking, buddy? What has got you knocking on the door? It's another carb. So what's got you so knocked up, Mr. C salmon? I can only imagine what he's gonna his response is gonna be with that. Come here. So what's got you so wound up, Mr. Simon? Why you be knocking on the door?
I will send you to Jesus fish if you don't come this way. Come on. Dang, this fish is really slow. This has got to be a big one now. Come on. 30 pounds. Holy smoke. 140 pounds now. We are already on 140 pounds. Also, did you get any sevens? What do you mean by sevens? Mr. Cars Ignite 95, what do you mean by that? That looks like a bream. Oh no, it's a car. Tiny one. Yeah, that's a tiny one. Holy smokes. Tiny one, ain't you? Don't you get it? Hint. A car. <laughs> no, but go fish. <laughs> I caught it right as soon as he said car. Nope, but go fish. Hey, Cars Ignite 95. Someone's got a question for you. Hey, Cars Ignite, is it Easter yet? <laughs> is it Halloween yet? Is it Christmas yet? <laughs> is it Christmas yet? No, we in the middle of March. No, January. No, no, it was, uh, it was New Year's and then he was like, oh, come on. Is it Christmas yet? No! And yet, and why are you here? You're interrupting my beauty sleep. Go away! Oh. <laughs> oh my god. That hit me out of nowhere. Okay. That's just the most randomest thing that has hit me by far. Oh my god. And if you don't get the reference of the Christmas thing, it's actually a video called In the Life of, Cr of Christmas Pig. <laughs> oh my god. Is it Christmas yet? No. We're in the middle of July. I cannot stop laughing about that video. I can't help but laugh at that video. This carp is really pushing up a fight now.
That's probably one of my favorite Angry Birds shorts I made by far. I have to agree with you. That short is the most funniest. And we're level 90! Let's go! We're no longer in the 80s no more! Heck yeah, bro. We're almost to 100. We're no longer in the 80s no more. We're now in the 90s. Let's go! What's up, guys? Cars Ignite here. Also known as Red Bird Ross. I, I'm completely butchered. I completely butcher that up. I don't go slay. No. What's up, guys? Ross here, and I have taken over Cars Ignite 95's channel. There we go. And that is just like that. We have officially won this tournament. Heck yes. Nice. I got 209 pounds. I have to say, this was the probably one of the most best tournaments by far. Because this was nothing but carps, and I actually like it. Unfortunately, we're going to have to say bye to the bait shack in, a few, in, the, in the last tournament. Because unless we're able to re, re, renew our contract with them, we no longer are able to... And there we go. Nice. See, look at all those be those carbs. We caught carbs nonstop in this match. And we win by 209 pounds. 500 points. And we got an earning of 58,479 with a total of 1,800 followers. So we're literally right behind Colin Fishery. Oh no, wait. No, I'm right behind. I'm on top of the world, baby. Alright, so now we are going to actually be heading towards the wind farm. And what do we deal with? Okay, so Sunset and Sunbelt. Because these two are going to be... Uh, because we just got one sunrise, two sunrise, three sunrise. We got sunset, sunrise, morning. Okay, so morning. Oh, we're going to be heading to Highway 6. E1. I mean, we're going to be heading to Lake Dillon here. Oh, man. Man, we're already on number 10. Let's keep going, man. I'm not, I'm not even getting bored. Are you guys getting... So, are you going... For 20 or 15. Hmm. Depending if you guys. Depending if you guys are enjoying it so far. I'm enjoying it. I just. I want to make sure you guys are enjoying it. You know. Go. Wait what the. This is a bass fishing right. Oh yeah this is. 
I guess we're going for freaking 20 or... F I'll just see how we feel once we get to one of those t one to 15. Let's see how we get to 15. And I feel like... If I feel like we can make it to 20 in this stream, then we could do it. But if I feel like if we're not going to have enough time, then we'll go... We'll try to go for f 15, uh, 20 another time. the next event on the tour with prize money and tour points up for grabs there's a lot at stake for each of our competitors so let's take a look at the rules ahead of today's competition all right beat five weighted bass and in this location there's apparently one species of bass so we're gonna have to really be eyes open for this one Again, a location I've not been to, but it looks nice. We're just going to drive around. Now, the question is, is there any places for the fishes to chill at? If not, then that means I'm going to have to do playing the old mind games of the mind old guessing game. I feel like we're going to have to go further down the lake. I don't know why, but I feel like we're going to have to go further down. I don't know. It's just something telling me we have to go further down this way. going to that tip over there on the bottom on the top on the top over there yeah we'll go for that tip maybe see what we can get out of it all right let's go to that tip over there i don't know if we're actually even allowed to go over there but we'll see we're almost there Technically, we're not... Technically, it ends right here, but this is actually not a bad spot. Alright. Alright, let's get to work. Alright, first up, we're gonna test out our bait. Like, before, we're gonna test out this bait before. Do the drag. Oh, I got ya! All right, so right off the bat, we got our first bass, I think. Jaden McDonald's has already got a has already got a lead on nine pounds, so we gotta make sure to beat that. And now Dylan Wicks has got ten pounds. All right. Not a big fish, but that still keeps us going. Two pounds. Okay, that's going to have to keep us going until we're able to get more. We need a big one. Give us the big one. Alright, somebody's eventually got a bite. All right, let's try maybe using this bait because I see some splashes on the water. Now ah, that's going to be way too slow. We ain't got time for this. What kind of jo jokes do fish tell? I don't know. What jokes do they tell? Ooh, 
Oh, come on. Somebody's got to come. Come on, there's got to be a fish in here. One light. One liners. Really? One liners. All right. Something's got to give. Come on, give us something. Come on. Something's got to... Why didn't the man eat the clownfish? Because he was too funny? Because he tasted funny? I mean, fishy? <laughs> I'm actually curious about that one now. <laughs> Come on. Somebody's got to get... I called it too! I called it! I knew it! Okay, I knew that. Uh, I knew that joke. I knew that. I knew that one, but that was funny. Because the, literally the way I knew it... Because it tasted funny. Okay, we got a two pound. I don't need no two pounds. I need a freaking big one. Give me. Give me, give me what I want. How do you talk to a fish? You have to, you have to, I guess, speak a bubble? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, this isn't funny now. You drop it. <laughs> You drop it. A line. <laughs> oh my god. Your jokes are funny. I'm talking about the game. The game is annoying because like, what in the world? I have been casting here for like, hours. What am I supposed to do? Don't you tell me I'm going to have to switch one of my lures, dude. Okay. Okay. I really hope that's a big bass and I'm not catching a catfish because that's going to be one very annoying thing. Yep. I think I caught me a catfish. Oh, no, it jumped. Oh, it jumped. It's a big bass. Give me it. I need it. I need this bass, dude. Come on. Come on. I'll tell you, the, it seems like it's getting tougher.
to get these fishes now. It seems so tougher to get these fishes now. Well, then again, this is a new map, so I have no clue. I'm definitely not coming here for now on. Like, for now on, when I go somewhere else, I'm definitely going to have to keep in mind not to come here. Okay. How big is this fish? Oh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. Mwah. Seven pounds. That's more like it. That's my size. Okay. Twelve it is. I will take it. Come on. To give me a reason, just a bit of love. Oops. Did not mean to cast over that sh shoreline. Alright. Got it! Okay. We only need a bit. We only need another one just so we can boost ourselves up. The Hita that just got straw, whatever his name was. Whatever this guy's name is, we're going to have a... He, him and I are going to competition this tournament, I feel like. Like, this bass tournament is now becoming the most difficult because of him. Alright. What do we got? Another bass. Five pounds. That's got to be enough. Yes, 17. Okay, we need to keep going with this. Now we have to get this in the bag. There's no doubt about it. There's no doubt about it. We have to keep this in the bag now. I'm sorry for all the fish puns. I feel... Bit gil. I'm sorry for all the fish puns. I feel a bit guilty. <laughs> I saw what you did. Good, <laughs> Good job. Oh, I hear thunder. Oh, that does not sound good. Uh, well. Oof, I hate, I hope the thunder does not frick with the stream, with the stream, because I hear thunder. I don't know if you guys heard that, but that was thunder. My dog caught me off guard for a... The dog caught me off guard for a moment. Nova! Chill, baby. Like I said, the dog caught me off guard. Okay. Oh my god, my mom's calling me right in the middle of a fish fight. Are you serious? Lord have mercy. Hold on a second, buzz that pun.
can't catch one break without getting a call from her. What the heck, mom? Blue Jay mom. Dude. Blue Jay mom's all over me. What the heck? What do fish, what fish do builder, do, what fish do builders, what? What fish do builders? Oh. Oh, it just confused me because you said what fish do builders like most. I thought you were going to say what do fish builders like most. It confused me, but <laughs> I get it now because the hammerhead is a hammer. Literally, it looks like a hammer. Huh. What's the difference between a piano and a fish? One has single one has singles, the fish have no singles. I could be wrong. Nothing so far. You could tune a piano, but you can't. <laughs> oh my god! I should have gotten that memo. Because you could tune a fish. I mean, you could. <laughs> you could tune a fish! But you, I meant to say you could tune a piano, but you can't tune a fish. Oh my god. Hey! Hey! This is how you tune a fish. You grab it. Put a uh, screw a thing on top of its head, and that's how you tune it. There you go. <laughs> Man, what am I? What have I done? Okay, I've not made no progress on this fishing thing at all. <laughs> I'm glad you think that's funny. I'm hoping I can get him continue keeping my first place because this guy is already in freaking 15 pounds. Dylan Wicks, stop what you're doing and stop trying to come near me. It's not happening. I will not let you take my crown. I'm already halfway where I'm at. You ain't gonna take my crown. In the entire heck was that in the water? Whoa! Oh, that is not a fit. That is not a bass. Oh no, that is a walleye. It is. It's a walleye, isn't it? It's a walleye, isn't it? I'm telling you, that's got it. It's a catfish! Oh my god! God, no, no, it is a walleye. I knew it. That is not what I want, though. Bro, what is this? What sorcery is this? Well, I'm going to lose because of this stupid walleye. See that freaking dude. Oh my.
my god, this vault. What kind of fish can you find in every building? Um. I don't know, what can you find in Oh, starfish! Xander! I don't know if that's a... Wait a minute, is that even a trophy catch name? Or that could be, might be a fish name! Dude! Oh my god, a wall eye. Dude, I can't... I don't know if that's a trophy catch... No, it wouldn't be a trophy catch, because it would say trophy catch on it. I think that's, that's, a, that's another species of the cousin wall eye. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, give me a bass, please! Please, I'm begging you, game! Don't do this to me! I love you! Don't do this to me! Come on, come on, give me a, give me a bass, give me a bass! Oh boy, I feel like he's gonna torment me. No! <sighs> well, looks like I'm returning to the boat dock, and I'm hoping for the best of luck. I'm hoping for the best of luck right now that I don't get beaten by him. Here's the boat dock. Alright, let's hope for the best. All right, we have parked in the boat deck area. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and done. Oh, that was barely what we were wanting. Oh, wait. Xander. Oh, that might be a trophy catch. I'll have to take a look. Dude, I might have gotten myself a trophy catch. Name. I might have. Because that had a crown on it. I'll have to take a look. 2,000 followers already. Boom. Let's go. 2,000 followers already. And I think we unlocked a new sponsor. Because of that fish right there. Because of that thing right there. Blue Jay player catches a hundred tenth a hundred fish. Blue Jay player wins tenth events. The Blue Jay player is currently in the first place. <laughs> Look at my name advertised everywhere. <laughs> I am spot on. All right, I gotta see anglers, anglers log. Uh, what was that lake called? Oh, I gotta find that. Let me find that in the uh, fishing trip. Lago del Mondo. That's it. I think that was the name. Yeah, that's it. That's the uh, fish we caught. La Gale del Mondo. La Gale del Mondo. Okay. Oh, it's not! No! I thought I caught one. I thought I caught... Oh, that was that's defeat. I forgot there's a species of walleye. Yep, there he is. There's the Xander I caught. <laughs> well, that was a side of defeat. I thought I actually had a legendary cat. That's a side of defeat. <laughs> Back to the career mode. Alright, we have... Oh, we don't have another sponsor sponsorship? What? Oh, God! Now they're wanting us to go with the top 20! Oh, Lord! Oh, Lordy! They've already wanted us to get to top 20. Oh, Lordy. And now we're going to the Road Lake. Oh, this is where things are about to get interesting. Oh, boy. 
Oh, Lake Johnson! Yes! One of my favorite spots. Oh, Lake Johnson, bro. We're gonna go in. Where do the fish keep their money? Um, in the aquarium? God, I join us here on the water today as the competitors are getting ready for the start of this I should have gone that in a river bank. In, let's take a look at the rules for today's tournament. In a river bank. Oh my god, a river bank. All right. Hopefully this goes smooth, because we're when the game first spawned me in a location. I shit. So I guess that's how they store their money now. Riverbank. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know there's a such thing as a riverbank. And where we got a catch. I'm here. Where are you? On a carp. Hey, let's go. And it's a big one, it looks like it. I mean, that, how do you think... Hey, I got one for you. Since we're talking about riverbanks, right? Alright, we got one here. Don't know if it's carp. Oh, it's a carp. Already in the lead with 19 pounds. Since you know we're talking about uh, riverbanks and stuff. I have a joke for you. You know how we're talking about riverbanks, right? Well, you so since there is a such thing as a riverbanks, uh, Jeremy Wade from River Monsters didn't tell you the fish live on the riverbanks for money. So whenever they need a loan, they go to the riverbank. So basically, Jeremy Wade is collecting his loans of money from the fish. In a way, basically, <laughs> basically, he bounty hunts the whom to get the money back. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay, I'm done. Oh my god. I've lost it. I have lost my mind. Oh. There we go. My indicators are not going off, which is not right is not right.
Hey, hero. I mean, hey, Karthik Knight. Got a question for you. What do, what do you call a tuba combined with a trombone? What do you call that? I mean, no, no, wait. Tuba and a bass. There we go. Two bass. Instead of a tuba, it's a two bass. <laughs> two bass. <laughs> two bass. Two bass. <laughs> Why? Why do I do these things to myself? <laughs> I like the fact I'm just fishing. I'm literally trying to do stuff. Okay. Now, you ready for another one? What do you call when you combine a hug and a muskie? Thirty-three pounds, dude. Nice. A hug ski. It's a hug ski. Instead of a musky and hug, it is hug ski. <laughs> Basically, you're hugging a musky and a hug. You combine a hug and a musky together, you get a hug ski. So basically, you're hugging a husky fish. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dying! <laughs> I'm dying over here! Uh, Lord, help me! Lord, have mercy on my soul! Oh, Lord. Okay, I gotta come up with another one. <clears throat> I'm trying to think of one that could be funny. Oh my god. Here is one for you. What do you call when you combine flame and wave together? And this is a hero's... Oh. What's what's officially his favorite day of the week? Oh, I should know this one. Monday. It's Mondays. Just like Garfield. Or is it Wednesdays? I'm just waiting. That is a big car! Fridays! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Cause you fry them! Fridays! <laughs> Alright. What happens when you call combine flame and wave? By the way, this is actually a Heroes Quest thing, because I've watched both Heroes Quest Season 1 and Season 2 and Season 3. So, what happens if you combine Flame and Wave? What do you get? I can't wait to tell him. <laughs> I can't wait to tell him this is going to be so stupid. I don't know why. Flames. You get flames. Basically, wave and flame combined, you get flames. <laughs> flames of water and flame. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, I'm dying. Holy smokes. 
Ah! Flames! Oh god! Oh, now I gotta do this! Since we're talking about Heroes Quest, like, joking about- Since I just came up with a joke for Heroes Quest. What happens when you combine a hero- a hero with a- with a churro? You get a hero- a churio. <laughs> a churio! the funniest time. This is why I love joking with somebody. If you guys ain't subscribed, you guys need to subscribe whenever you guys watch these replays because you're going to realize very fast you're missing out some entertainment. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Why is the... Why did... Why would- why is Tony- here you go. Why is Tony f from Angry Birds always in Finland? In the snow. Fishing. I'm just waiting for Cause he's fishing for snow deans instead of sardines like mighty eagle cans. He's fishing for snow deans. Snow de snow de danes. I can't really say it. Snow deans. Basically, it's just a block of snow of sn of fish of snow fish combining in a can, and you get snow deans. <laughs> oh my god! I'm literally just coming up with these jokes out of my own freaking butt. Oh lord. Oh lord, I have never died this b much before. Um. <clears throat> okay. You ready? I'm gonna say a little actual a quote. I'm gonna say a joke. So the bass went to see the sm the large mouth went to see the small mouth, right? Small mouth bass asks, "Hey, large mouth, why are you why is your mouth so large?" You know what his comeback was? <laughs> I can't wait to tell this comeback. This is gonna get me in so much trouble. I gotta reel this fish in. The large mouse comment, I mean, come back, or yeah, come back was at least I could shove some minnows. What is your mouth for? Shoving up seeds? Basically say the large mouth can have shovel shove more minnows than the small mouth. And basically he's roasting the small mouth for having such a small mouth that he could literally shove seeds in there. He could shove small things in there. <laughs> he could shove more minnows in his mouth than the small mouth can. <laughs> oh my god. Now I'm going to have to re-fix that joke. This fish was a big one. 32 pounds! And we have reached level 91. <laughs> yes! Y'all gonna make me lose my mind up in here!
up in here. Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. <laughs> my god. Uh, Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. Up in here. Up in here. Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. Up in here. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, here's a good one. Why is a tiger musky called a tiger musk? Called a tiger. I'm just waiting to tell him this. Tiger was like say, "Hey, you can't come on land, so I'll turn you into a mu I'll turn I'll turn myself into a fish so you can roar like me." Basically saying he can have claws like the tiger and have a mouth like a tiger. So basically that's why they're called tiger muskies is because they they could be like a tiger in the o of the water. Oh my god. <clears throat> After this, I'm going in a little intermission so I can get, excuse me, something to eat. Because I know I'm going to be streaming for a few more, uh, for for the next hour at 11, until 11, 12 or 11, 15. Because I want to see how far we get into, the cert, into these tournaments and whatnot. Now I'm just going to pack it up. I'm just going to wait here for another fish. And if nothing comes, we've won this tournament. Because literally, we've won this tournament. Well, what's getting bit? Number three. We got another one. No, I gotta think of I gotta think of something funny. Why does Matilda look like a chi chicken? I'm about to get I'm about to go because because her father was like stop being a chicken and go out there and show me your battle cry no here up cars ignite her father said stop being a chicken and go out get, and go out there and give me your battle cry cuz get it She's chicken because she's scared. Get it? Okay, so we caught our fish and we are at 217 point of eight pounds. How did you know I was referencing? The Angry Birds Fantastic Adventures. How did you know? Well, then again, he already knows me, so. <laughs> Dang, I can't believe you actually got that. So after this tournament, I'm actually going to go get me something to eat. I'm going to actually bring my food in here because I'm going to actually eat it and stuff while I play this game. Well, I'm actually going to eat while I actually talk to you guys. 
Two out of 17 pounds. I cannot believe I beat those guys. has been going on for three hours and I'm surprised honestly I'm enjoying this now I'm gonna drink my drink here Excuse me. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and boom. Look at that. Not even a single bream or any of those were caught in this match. I say I'm satisfied. I am satisfied with this. Heck, yes. We, a tiny fish tried to roast a shark. What was the shark's comeback? Um, I would roast you, but you're so tiny that I could literally just sit on you. <laughs> That's my guess. <laughs> That's my guess. Hey, right, so we got, we officially have satisfied the bait shack with their top 20 and everything and we got seventy four thousand four hundred fifty four thousand dollars that worth with two thousand uh, twenty two two thousand two hundred followers we are getting up there ladies I would roast you, but your shrimp. I was close enough. I was close enough to that to that joke. I was close to that joke. I was so close, man. I was so close. Of course, I'm bringing them back. I was so close to that joke. And now we are actually going to Lake Johnson, one of my favorite spots of this game. Heck yes. Okay. So, I will be right back. I am going to get myself some food. So, Blue Jay Place will be right back in a moment.
All right, I'm back and I got my chicken. I got everything here, so I actually am going to switch to a. I'll just put the starting screen, starting soon thing, here in a little bit. I mean, I'll bring that back later, but. Here we are. You get to actually see me literally talk to you guys. You can ask me questions while I eat because literally I'm trying to eat so I can have so we can have a good stomach on here. And I'm usually very fast, so this shouldn't take too long. Of course I gotta turn down the volume to the game. Okay, let's get it all up in here. Oh shoot, I am starving right now. Mm. And what I'm having for dinner, chicken! Oh, this sucker's probably hot. Ow! Yeah, it's hot. That's my fault, Dad. Gum it. Mm. So, are you guys enjoying the career mode, by the way? Because I want to actually know if you guys are enjoying it. Because we're, I'm enjoying every bit of it. I'm glad you're enjoying it, Cars Ignite. It's freaking long work, but. <laughs> Broke my mouth. Mm -mm. I freaking burnt my mouth. Ow, that hurt. That burnt. Ow. Bro, I can imagine a real freaking joke right now. Why is my camera bl blurry? Can you stop being blurry for once? Have you heard about the fish <laughs> at the baseball game? What fish are we talking about? Hmm? What fish are we talking about? Depends on what fish you're talking about. Are we talking about uh, the Sam? Are we talking about Bass? Bassy. <laughs> Bassy. Bassy. Oh, this is hot. He got battered. Oh my god. This thing is hot. Oh my god. He got battered. Now here is a question for the both of y'all. Here is the question for y'all. What is your favorite thing? to eat whenever you guys are in a whenever you guys are in a good mood to eat something what is your favorite thing to eat it could be anything fast food home cooking any of that like let me know what you guys like to eat i shouldn't get like as soon as i get um, this the lifetime membership because of my brother i am actually going to actually add a third section where it's called food time with BJ. Pizza? What you mean? Explain yourself. Why pizza? Oh, question. Does that come with a cherry Coke? Because I know how much you love that cherry Coke. 
Oh my god. Yep, do it. For you guys who don't know, if you guys are wondering what this is, this is my new uh, diet uh, drink that I've been doing. Well, it's technically not even a secret. It's Kool-Aid. I actually stopped doing soda like 2018. I actually stopped doing soda because I got sick and stuff. And I actually, like, I'm not going to say how it did, but I'm just going to say rejected out all that stuff. So now I no, lo no longer drink soda. I drink more of, uh, I mean, if I have to drink soda of someone's place that, that does, they don't have juice, then I'm fine with it. But if it's like caffeine free or something, I'll deal with that. But if it's not caffeine free, I'm not interested. I try to stay away from caffeine. And I see your comment, really? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, snap into a slim gym. If only retro completionist was here. My brother. Gotta have beef. Gotta have spice. A little excitement. Snap into a slim gym. Oh yeah. Freaking missed that. May he rest in peace. Macho Man was such a good wrestler. I don't care what nobody says. When that man literally did his job, he did it right. Now you're probably wondering, where did I get this chicken from? I actually got it from Publix. Which is my store. I love Publix chicken. The fried chicken from Publix is fire. There's actually an old lady. That actually works there. Such a sweet woman. And literally. Okay I'm actually going to tell you guys something. So when I went to get the chicken today. With my dad. Because I had to stop by. This guy. Was. Was impatient i don't know if it was his tone but it's not like he was getting irritated and he wanted this mashed potatoes because i just happened to hop behind him and he was giving me these w weird looks anyways i went to get the chicken i had to wait for the guy to get his stuff guy's complaining he wants mashed potatoes french fries and stuff right well the guy literally the woman the old lady literally is telling him we're not i'm not sure i'll see what i can do about getting more in and as soon as she goes to tell him, I mean, as soon as she goes to ask the people in the back, the chefs, of course, the guy literally, as soon as she tells him it's going to be a while, he's like, okay, well, never mind. I don't want nothing. I'm gone. And he just walks away like all mad and stuff. It's like, dude, it's not her fault that all the food's out. Like, she's just serving it. So what's the problem? Like, what do you guys, in your opinion, think about that? I think it's kind of horrible that that situation went down. Who agrees that it could have went a lot smoother? I think it should have. Another question I wanted to ask, too, what do you guys think of the green screen? I know I asked um, my sister-in-law the day she came on the day one stream. She never hasn't came back. But what do you guys think of the green screen? Do you think it's amazing? Because, literally, I wanted to show my love and support for this game, like, like, I cannot wait for this game to come out in on the 31st. I've already got literally everything propped up for this point. For this game to get out.
This is delicious chicken. Oh my god. I gotta be careful not to hit that bone. Mm. Done. And just like that. Look at that. All those bones. Ha! Doesn't take me too long to eat at all. So I'm gonna go ahead. Go take this to the kitchen. With all the bones in it, and then we're gonna start the stream, get to number 15. Well, if I feel lucky, I'm gonna go number 20, but we'll see. Anyways, be right back. Intermission again. I will be right, right, right back. All right, it is time to get back into action on the to, to whatever number I feel like we'll make it to. All right, gotta find the remote. Where is it? Oh, right here. So. All right. Let's get started. Now we are going to my all-time favorite location. We are going to literally my all-time favorite location of this game. Lake Johnson, Florida. Like besides um besides Lake John besides uh Lake Arnold, of course. This is my most personal favorite lake. Because Lake Johnson, I really wish they would have added it, but Lake Anchitobee would sound perfect in this game. It's an old, it's like an awesome map. I love it. I mean, awesome lake. Awesome location. There she is, Lake Johnson. Beautiful location. Greetings everybody and welcome to the next event on the tour. 
While the competitors are making their final checks over their tackle, let's take a look at the rules for today's event. All right. As always, the best way to pass. 500 points. Oh yes! Please tell me it's spawning right me right on the good stop spot. Yes! One of my favorite spots too. Heck yes! Spawn me right in the right location too. This is my most favorite spot of this whole entire lake. And Cars Ignite knows what I'm talking about. So Cars Ignite, do you remember that spot I showed you? In the other stream? Because we're about to go to it right now. It is right here, y'all. Go around this corner. You go around this corner. It's somewhere around here. I could be in the wrong spot, but I don't care. This is one of my favorite locations to go to. These seaweed bed bedded areas is so great because this is the area you need to go to if you're going to catch some bass. Because here's why. In this area, this is where most of the bass hang out at. Please reply to my Google chat. Wait, what's going on? I'll see what I can do. There she is. Oh my god. Five pounds. Let's go. Good job, bro. Really? For real? That is one thing that really gets annoying. Got it. There you are, bro. Thank you, Cars Ignite, for stopping by. I'm just gonna pretty much probably wrap up at number 15. I'll, who knows? There we go. Hold up. Come here. See you around, Cars Ignite. Talk to you soon, my man. Oh, that's a nice one. Holy smokes. That's what I mean. This location is good for bass population. Like, you don't even have to worry about not even getting a single bass in this area. Because there's just so many areas you could go to that has baths. They're in here.
Hold on, guys. Sorry guys, I had an intermission. My sister just arrived back home, so. Okay. Let's keep going back. <sighs> so yeah, as soon as we get to the Highway 65, I feel like I'm going to stop right there. But we'll see how I feel like doing. There we go. That's a big bass, too. Let's go. That's got to be a trophy. It's not, but it's a nine-pounder. I'll take it. Man, we've been, we, I'm not gonna lie, we have been on a winning streak. 
even though those night ones almost messed us over, we've been on a winning streak, and now we're gonna be on a, we're gonna about to be on another winning streak because of this because of this location. Oh my god, my lion's going crazy. There we go. I had to adjust it. It was going crazy for a moment. Another big bass, it seems like. See, this is what I mean when it comes to these locations. This kind of location. I've tested this location, like, for quite a while. Because this was, like, the first map I actually got into for the uh, Fish, Fish and Sim World Pro Tour. This is actually the first map I got into. And I immediately fell in love. Because, like I said, all the all the repella game, the one repella game I used to play, actually there was two of them. I had the repella uh, pro fishing, which was on the PlayStation 2 and the PC, because I actually got it. Um, what else? There was also another game I used to play that had something similar to Florida. I think it was the repella pro bass fishing, which was the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360's version of Rapala Pro Fishing, but better. Alright. This one's fighting pretty good. And there we go, we netted that fish. Heck yes, and that's a big one too. Trophy catch, and it's 12 pounds. Heck yes, bro. Look at us go. And nice cast. Let's go. But yeah, this is why I love this game. This game is literally like the greatest like I play this more than fishing planet like when I first heard of this game it was actually when I was watching the uh the European fishing sim game that dovetail made back in the day and then this game was recommended to me right after I watched that video and then I watched it and I was like this game is god amazing because don't get me wrong I love fishing planet it's cool the mechanics is amazing but the only problem I have is that if they would not had added in-game, like, the microtransaction to the game, where you have to buy bait coins for every single I certain items that you have to buy, and stuff, and I'm like, there's just no point. Like, that's what I like about Call of the Wild, the Hunter Call of the Wild. There's no microtransactions. The company tends to never plan to add that, ever, and which, thank you. God, I hope they don't, because the the classic is good, only to a certain limit, because then you have to buy EMs and stuff for the certain games that you want. I mean, for the certain items that you want. And stuff. And I have everything that I basically own. I own the pictures, I own the... I own pretty much everything. I just don't like the fact that... That game is was microtransaction, but the only reason why I feel like, but the understanding why, but I understand why because back in the day they used to do license, like game, like in-game licensings, like and stuff like basically if you wanted to buy a license, you could go hunting for the rest of those other animals and stuff, which I completely understand why they did it, but I just I still do, don't understand why make the game have microtransaction. And then the EMs are literally the cheapest compared to the GMs. The GMs is literally the most expensive prices for, compared to the EMs. Because, like, I just don't understand that. That's why I bought most of the most of the product of the game with EMs. But I get people say, oh, just do the missions and stuff. But even with the missions, you don't really have that good much of a gun guns and stuff. And you have to literally do that. I mean, Scarecrow did that on his own channel. I think he did uh, 
where he completed the missions with on, that only you need GMs for, and I think, and I think he said it takes a long time for you to get that. So I think he pretty much did like all of it. I think I'm not sure, but I know he uh, pretty much did. He pretty much did something along those lines. But other than that, I love the classic. Classic, in my opinion, is really good. For like for its prime time with the graphics and stuff, I kinda it's really cool how the game came to be has came so far since 2009. So, but yeah, I'm, that's what I'm thankful for the company is that like Call of the Wild, the Hunter Call of the Wild never got microtransactions, although you have to pay for certain of the DLCs, which I mean, why wouldn't you buy all of them? I mean, come on. The game is amazing. Like I own every DLC, including the newest one, the Finland DLC. And same goes with the, the Dovetail Fishing Sim World. I own every DLC in this game. Because this game is amazing. Like, if this game is really that good, I will buy every bit and penny of this game. Because this game is so worth it. And that the fact that I own every item in this game, because I work so hard to earn, like, have everything. Jan! Holy smokes, my boy! Oh my god! I have to add you, I have to add you to the moderator list. Oh my god, Jan! My boy! Well, hello, Jan. It's good to see you here. Man, I, I hope you're having a great day, dude. Like, how's your... How's your day going? Like, are you having a great day up where you live at and everything? But yeah, as I was saying, though, I would... Like, I literally own every DLC to the Hunter Call of the Wild and in this game. But unfortunately, they don't make no more DLCs. Fantastic days as always. That's good. Uh, Karzik Knight was actually here, but he had to go. I don't know if you, uh, I don't know if you can see his message, but he had end up, he ended up leaving for the stream, so I'm now currently, he's now currently, uh, doing stuff as we speak, I guess. I understand why he had to go. I mean, he has a whole bunch of things going on and stuff, including with the move. But once he gets that resolved and everything, that should be good. So is, how's uh, Sonic treating you? How's the games treating you? Yeah, it don't seem like I'm going to catch anything now. They're treating me pretty well sometimes. <laughs> hey, hey, them games can treat you sometimes good or sometimes bad, depending on the day. Depending on the days that you play the game, they're going to treat you sometimes either good or bad. The way I view it, as long as the game's fun to play, I'm happy with it. Now I'm going to cast over here because it seems like those fishes wasn't biting over there. Okay. Okay. 
And then also, Cars Ignite was literally cracking up some puns and stuff. And I'm like, I was over here dying. So, I, uh, I was, I'm having such a great night. Like I said, I'm just having the greatest night. Some fish puns. LOL. Yes. Him and his fish puns. I love it. Because literally, normally, no one e ever even comes on the chat. Sometimes I'll have, like, people here and there from, like, my old subscribers and stuff just come and stop by. But usually they never come and stay. Or, I mean, come and app or chat. But I've always dealt being alone and stuff whenever I'm streaming. But whenever I have friends here, I'm just, like, enjoying my time. So... Come on, one fish has got a bite. Come on. Okay, I think this game is just telling me to just stop fishing over here. Oh, crud. Or right, let's see how this cast can be. Oh, this cast is actually might be good. How many fish have you got so far? I've gotten, like, I've done... Literally almost the whole half of the tournaments. Like, um, I started that one, I can't remember what it was called, but I started this one tournament, and we, from there, we just basically are now made it to the Lake Johnson tournament now, which is, like, in my opinion, one of my most favorites. All right, well, I'm getting back to the boat dock. Heck yes, dude. This is why I love this location right here. I caught it like a whole lot today. But yeah, so but yeah, so if you don't know, I think you already know by the title. I'm counting down to one of the games that's actually gonna be coming out um in the end of this month. I'm I actually got the game already in my wish list, like I've already said to people. To wish list the game whenever you get the chance because the game's literally coming out this month we only got three weeks and i am literally and the game the best thing about that game it's cross play it's cross play so not only will you get to actually play on pc but you can actually play with uh not only will you actually get it but you got us to play with ps4 play play i don't know what console players are going to be in but for so far from what we were told Epic game players will actually get to play with Steam players, and Steam players will get to play with Epic players. So basically, every PC player that goes from those two to the stores will actually be able to crossplay with pretty much those two stores will crossplay. And then, as the consoles get a release date, they're also going to be crossplaying with PC users along with Xbox users. So I'm very excited that this game is actually cross is getting a crossplay mechanic. Because we've been ask, I've been asking for that since 2017 when the when the Hunter Call of the Wild came out, and boom! Look at all those fishes. And that trophy bass got me up there too. And just like that, no one can outbeat me in my location of Lake Johnson. This is my favorite, favorite location. No one can ever outbeat me in this location. $82,000, 2,400 followers. No one can ever outbeat me. Um, did I unlock another sponsor? Not yet. So, oh, shoot, no way! Hey, yo, let's go! <laughs> Heck, yeah, boy! I want to get in. I have got to actually get myself some. Oh my god, all those sponsors! Oh my god, I got my daggum sponsors that I want. Bro. 
bro. My favorite sponsor, Nicholas Lures. I am actually so tempted to actually have this as my sponsor. Because, like, don't get me wrong. I actually have um, the Bait Shack and all these other companies. And, you know what? I'm going to keep Bait Shack going for a little bit. So as soon as the sponsor goes out, then I have to renew that sponsor. Um, we're going carp fishing in the Netherlands because I know that flag right there is the Netherlands. Actually, we got two carp fishing, huh? We got two carp tournaments. We got, yeah, we got two carp tournaments. I've noticed we got one in Domain Saint Christopher Christoph. And then we got the Sun Drench, which is that uh, Del Lego de Mando, Lego de Mando uh, location. And then, of course, we got two bass fishing. Okay. All right, let's go. But yeah, this literally is all I've been doing. And I can't believe I just unlocked that freaking membership. So I'm not going to add any other sponsors right now. I'm going to keep the sponsors that I got right now. Once I get more followers and stuff, I'm going to start adding all sponsors all on my outfit. And I'm going to show off my style like crazy, dude. Okay, so we have Oblivion, Stock Pond, the Sink, the Pink. Alcatraz. What? Hello and welcome to the venue for the next event on the tour. While the competitors are getting ready for the action to begin, let's take a look at the rules for today's event. I wonder why they call this part Alcatraz. What in the world? Alcatraz is that prison in the in real life. Oh my god. So we just cast this. Tiger nuts go there. So um So uh what's um this is a curiosity question, Jam. What, is, what do you plan on doing for your birthday? Do you have any plans on what you're going to be doing for your birthday or whatnot? We're still planning. Oh! Oh, so are you still planning it all out? I feel like I'm gonna go to that stock pond over there. That's crazy, you guys are still planning. I thought you would have it already all planned out and whatnot. <laughs> you know? I can't go that way. Seriously? I 
Actually, my mom told me just now that she already has one. Coincidence. I like how she planned it right as soon as you say you have no idea. That's funny. I like how she, how you say you have no idea and she said we already actually have one already planned. It's like, that's funny. Alright, I'm gonna cast Far Out and maybe see what we can get. Alright, let's see what we get. This is all that is, is weeds? Seriously? Oh, lordy. I am in trouble. one's got it okay this one's got one just reel this sucker in that is crazy how like literally as you say you have no idea what your plan is and literally they say and they're like and your mom tells you what the heck ah. so oh jeez I'm trying to think of something else to talk about. Oh! How's gold treating you, man? Is gold driving you crazy as always? <laughs> oh my goodness. Because the last time... Cause the last time we see, we saw him, he he was drop. He literally, he literally, literally said something bad, and you was like, "I'm gonna get you for that." I might have to start casting my line over to the right, because this is how I got that carp. Sometimes pretty annoying, taking up most of the space in the couch, but sometimes he's all right. Man, it's taking up all the space in the couch. Oh, man. Gold! You're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to take up the whole entire space of the couch. I thought you knew better not to take up the space of the couch. George Carter, Catter, and Sean, Sean and Evans are up in the league, are almost a tie. I'm gonna keep going until 12 o'clock and then I'm. Oh, crud. Come on! Come here. These carps are the most annoying fish to just get themselves in, in here.
Come on. But question is, Jan, who takes up the couch more? Gold or your buddy has? Yes, I'm in the lead. Let's go. Let's keep it that way. Yeah, let's keep it that way. Definitely <laughs> I thought it'd be your boy house. Because, I mean, think about it. Your boy Hal is always about taking over, taking space. Because, I mean, think about it. You got that big Hal, too. Come here. This has got to be a big one if this thing is fighting like crazy. There we go. 29 pounds and level 92. Let's go. Now we just gotta cast over here. And there we go. There's number one over there. Catching these big ones like it ain't nothing, bro. One's already got a fish on. Let's go. This game... But yeah, uh, like I said... Though, this game, though, I bought every bit and penny of the DLCs, including that Bass Pro Shop bundle, which gives you, like... The licensed Bass Pro Shop equipment and stuff from Bass Pro Shop themselves and stuff. And I enjoy... I am so proud that I own everything because it literally just gives me the literally something to do whenever I'm playing this game. Because, I mean, like I said, if you don't have anything to do, then there's something wrong. Come here. There we go. Brought him in finally. I have fun catching these carps. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Carp fit. Oh. Carp fishing and uh, bass fishing, in my opinion, is the funnest thing. That's why I got both sponsors for my... Uh... I mean, that's why I got both sponsors on my outfits, because I love this game. I love these uh, two sports a lot. Sounds like three is about to get taken, and it is...
Come here! Now I'm trying to think of it. Oh! Jan, question. Do you play Minecraft by any chance? There we go. 20 pound leather cart. Let's go. There's another one right there, too. I don't really play him. Why? How so and why? I'm confused. What makes you not want to play it as much? There we go. Finally, he submitted. I was like, when are you going to give up? Oh, I love the, the, the cart. I don't know. Maybe because of school. Because my first day is tomorrow. Wait, your school start... Oh, right. That's right. You're starting first day of school, like, early. You do it, you do it earlier compared to us in America. That's right. I keep forgetting. I feel like just putting two rods out would just do the trick. I'm just going to cast right over here. And we just leave it right there. I was, I am not going to lie, I did think I was going to get beaten. Which one's already got one? There we go. Two's already got one. Let's go. That's crazy. That's crazy. I forgot that you start school soon. Okay, now can you come in and stop fighting? There we go. Twenty seven pound mirror carp. All right, let's get this last rod reeled in, and we are done. Yeah, unfortunately, I wasn't able to go around the fence because the gate is closed. Which makes no sense, the fact that there's like a trail that goes around the park. Well, this lake, in general.
There you go. And we are done with this tournament. Yes, look at us. This tournament has turned out smooth. And we pretty much got the one last tournament to complete for the night, which is another carp tournament. And that will get us up to number 15, which I am actually going to stop at right as soon as I get through the last one. Now we just sit, relax, and just get ready for the final one. Because I'm honestly not going to lie. This is a lot of work. There we go. 30 seconds. <laughs> I'm surprised how I'm beating these guys. Like, like, I got the most powerful fishing rod, and I got the most powerful fishing... Uh, I got all the lures, I got all the hooks, I got all the bait. Like, you name it. I got everything in this game, except for the clothes. But I understand why I'm not going to buy those, because... There's just no point of buying all those clothes and stuff. Because I'm literally, like I said, there's just no point. And just like that, we got the this tournament in the bag. We won first place. 700 points. Holy smokes. $90,000. 90600 dollars six hundred sixty dollars net worth with two thousand six hundred followers the final one let's do this yep the final one which is the final carp fishing going into number 15 and then we got 16 17 18 19 20 and then we're gonna try to finish it up on the final 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 one which is Lake Nelson in Texas like we're gonna try to finish this all up on the on the uh in the next stream so let's go finally finish this final one and we'll end up on four on the 15 and 16 on 15 so let's do this don't have to switch the tackle let's go do this final one never fished here well i fished in this map before but it's a different it's kind of weird. This is like a... It's the same map, but it's not because it's technically where all the boats and stuff hang out. Hi there, and welcome to the next event on the tour. With prize money and tour points up for grabs, there's a lot at stake for each of our competitors. So let's take a look at the rules ahead of today's competition. Alright. They both expect us top 20, so let's go do this. We're already 700 points, so if we complete this, this will give us a grand total of 800 points. What the? Hold, hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute. How the frick are you expecting us? Man, 
man, something's not right. I... Hold on. I... I don't understand this tournament already. This is, like, confusing. What am I supposed to do? I know I'm supposed to catch a carp, but what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to put a bobber and then catch it? What? Okay, this one's got me way confused now. I was expecting more of the, uh... Okay, hold on. Uh... Jen, you seen this? It's making me want to fish a carp thing in a boat. What? What? You're kidding me, right? You want me to do what? In this tournament? Oh my god, this has got to be the most horrible idea I have ever heard of this deal, this map, dude. Fishing on a boat. So you're telling me, I gotta go find a location. Cast my line out. Or, I could have stayed on the boat. Oh, my God. I just thought of it. I could have stayed on the dock. My stream was lagging. What? For real? You're telling me your stream's lagging now? That is bull crap. How? How just how just how do you expect me to literally Now I'm so confused on what I'm supposed to do. Oh my god, I'm about to go back on the docks. I'm fixing to quit this and refix, retry because I'm so confused right now. Yeah, I'm quitting this. This has got me confused. What am I supposed to do? That's got me... Wow, that's got me blown. Okay, well... Lesson learned, kids. Lesson learned. Stay on the dock if you're going to go fishing for carp. Because that was kind of not a good idea what I just witnessed. I am staying on the dock. I don't care how I got to stay on the dock. I am just staying on the dock. That just was... That's... There has to be a way. There's no way you can fish on a boat for a car. Like, what? You join us here on the water today as the competitors are getting ready for the start of this exciting event. While we wait for the action to begin, let's take a look at the rules for today's tournament. Okay, well, I think I've learned something brand new. I'm not messing with that boat. Heck, no, there is no way I'm messing with that boat. Nope, nope, nope. If I have to, I'm just going to figure it out.
Oh, what is it? Oh, it's a bat. Are you kidding me? I don't want a bass. Are you serious? I gotta let him go. He's stuck. Wait, is it Tinch? Or is it a carp? I don't need no carp. I mean, Tinch. I need a carp. Ugh. I'm getting irritated right now. Ugh. Hey, at least we now know it works. The other fish will come for it. Dude, I'm, I'm gonna have to probably practice this event, dude. Take care, Dan. I'll talk to you tomorrow, bro. Like, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I am so confused. Oh my god, I'm so confused. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god, I'm so confused right now. I might have to practice this off stream just so I can figure it out the next time I go for it. Yeah, that one's got me on a loop. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Um, okay. Well, on that note, I'm going to have to practice that off screen. So, I think I'm going to pause it right here on number 14. Number 14's got me all trapped and confused right now. So, anyways, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked it, hit like and subscribe to join the Blue Jay Army. And I will see you guys in the next video. Blue Jay Player. Bye, guys.